Hello and welcome to Freely Hold Creative. I'm Liberty, your creativity coach from freelyhold.com, where we're making beauty from ashes through creative soul care. Today's project is a colorful pinwheel birthday card. Join me on the journey and let's create. I started with a two and a half inch strip of colorful paper. Since the back was plain, I sprayed it with several distress sprays to get some color there too. Then I cut my base and my mat out of white cardstock. The base is eight and a half inches by seven inches and scored at three and a half inches. The mat is three and a quarter by eight and a quarter inches. Next, I stenciled my big polka dots onto the matte piece with Distress Oxide ink and a blender brush. Then I cut three two and a half inch squares out of my pattern paper and folded them diagonally each way. Then cut on each of those folds till you're about a quarter of an inch from the center. Next, I put many glue dots onto the same corners of each of the four triangles of each of the pen wheels. Then I folded each of those corners into the center, adhering them onto the top of each other. Next, I adhered a gem into the center of each of the pinwheels. If they weren't sticky enough, I added a small glue dot to the back of those two. Then I cut thin strips of light brown cardstock to make my pinwheel sticks. The next step I should have done after I glued my mat to my base, but I didn't. I arranged my pinwheels and my sticks onto my mat. Then I used larger glue dots to adhere the pinwheels onto the mat. Next, I glued the brown cardstock sticks underneath the pinwheels. Then I trimmed those strips even with the bottom of my mat. Next, I did what I should have done before I put my pinwheels on my mat, and I adhered my mat to my card base. And there we have it, a cute little colorful pinwheel card, ready to deliver to a cute little girl for her birthday. Now, I recommend that you hand deliver this or put it in a padded envelope, as if you stick it in a regular envelope, it will get smashed while it's being delivered. So, what do you think about today's project? Comment below and let me know. Thanks for joining me on our creative journey today. Don't forget to subscribe so you won't miss any more creative videos coming your way. And I'd appreciate a thumbs up if you like this project. In addition to sharing with your friends, please share your take on this project with our creative community. 
The links are below. If you like this project, check out this one too. Now, go make beauty from ashes and may your life be freely whole.